Hello there. Welcome to our wardrobe. His and hers. This side is mine and this side is his. Officially, in reality, he takes more of the space. Recently, he went through his side of the wardrobe like a bull in a china show. I'm throwing out at least 50, maybe 75 shirts that I've accumulated over the years. When I say throwing them out, I'm giving them to the Save the Children Fund. I'm being ruthless as I should have been long ago. It is literally half empty. Yeah, it's not right. The accumulation of unused things. Will you help me tidy up my uh, wardrobe? Yeah, sure. But I warn you, I'll be ruthless. So we've got lots and lots of clothes. We work in media, so we need a lot of outfits, especially now that my husband is on the screen every day. That is his reason for having more clothes than me. So I'm not minimalist but I do want to reduce. This little bump prompted me to actually go ahead with the spring clean, but because I'm not so good in deciding, uh, today I've got the help of the bull in the china shop, my husband. Press ganged into it, I should tell you. Press ganged into it or not, you're here right now. So, shall we start taking the clothes out? Yes, I'll take them out one by one and, and see them. whether we keep them or not. Okay. Definitely keep that. Even though it's falling apart, honey? actually called after you this is my first name and as you can see uh, i am a fan of keeping labels on but this is this i literally have never worn yet so we keep that we keep that because that's what i need for when i'm in my traditional attire where do the things you're getting rid of go so this one you don't want anymore it no. is too big for me anyway see the thing is that i can't make a choice so if he says i need to chuck it we have to chuck it Better keep that national national events at the embassy yes. and so on this is an ikat pattern from the east of indonesia okay get rid of that you, have a, you don't even know what this is now this one i'm so sorry this one i will object because this i've had for a long time and this is perfect for pregnancy sort of 60s jackie kennedy yeah this one is very nice keep i'll throw that out this this literally has my name on it and why i designed this one when i was 15 years old and if this is one of the features of it. It was very trendy to have sleeves that go all the way up to your finger. You know, this is the middle finger, so the middle finger goes here. So, so I yeah. remember that trend, but it's nice. <laughs> I'd get rid of that. Yeah. I've been using it a lot. It doesn't do anything for me. Okay, okay. I, um, I, I know I said I was listening to everything well, you said. You remember, you remember she said I was doing the choosing, right? <laughs> well, I'll show this to you. I, I know, it's just a boohoo shirt. Again, charity shop. This is nice. Keep that. So you don't think this is a bit 60s? No. I don't like either of them. If you want them, you keep them. Okay, no. Don't tell the viewer that I'm making a decision when you're actually making it. No, I can't make a decision, that's why. I'll get rid of that. This? Yeah. This is uh, another iconic one. I wear yeah, a lot. Keep this. I bought you this and you've hardly worn it. We bought this when we were in Madrid. Yeah. To no, shoot David Kelly. David Kelly. This is very nice. Yeah. Oh, this one I have not worn yet. I'd get rid of that again. National. Oh, yeah, it's a nice one. This is another attic poultry. Yeah, again, I have not worn that one yet. Your wedding, no? No, no, but it is very nice. They're nice, these Indonesian things. Mm -hmm. I and should wear uh, batik more often. This, uh, dear viewer, is an Armani second hand, of course. A suit Ladies that suit. I literally have never seen on her. No. You see, this is the ikat, and you know what? Handmade in Indonesia, and you know what? This used to be my mom's. I haven't seen you in this either, suede. Oh, this is so beautiful, remember? Very beautiful. Oh my God. Not much going out. It's washed out. Thai silk for my auntie, but never wear it really. Yeah, he, he won't understand that this is another traditional attire that you wear with batik underneath. The top one for my cousin from Bali. I'll get rid of that top shop. Also from second hand. I'll get rid of that. Honey, we had our prenuptial in this one and I wore the jewelry with it that you bought for me. Okay. So you still want to get rid of it? No, keep that one. I'll get rid of that too. This one? I'll get rid of that. This is nice. Yeah, we got great pictures in this one. I don't fit it at the moment. I'll get rid of that. Yeah. Chinese. This is from Beijing, literally. I get rid of that. It's also a classic. No, no. I give it to the charity. I like this one. In Indonesia, it's very common to get your um, fabric and then have it made to measure. I get rid of this. I don't mind. 
This one comes with a skirt. Nice, keep that. My, for my cousin who used to be an air hostess. Like a tent and the wrong color. Extremely unfashionable. Batik has to be kept. And get rid of this. This is a two-piece um, dress suit. I think he needs to see me in it just to remind him of it. I know I don't wear it very often. I keep that. I love my Peggy French crop jacket. So beautiful. I had this also from a vintage shop a long time ago. I'm getting rid of that. You don't like this one? No. I like this one. No, no. I got this when I was pregnant of Torin. Me and my sister, we buy a and we share it. So I think it's her turn to have it now. I'll get rid of that. Yeah, this is a very simple one from Bryce. I'll get rid of that. No, this is a gorgeous one. Indonesia. I wore this one when we, when I did Sputnik. You were in London and I was in Bali and I was reporting on the Indonesian elections and I was wearing this. I don't know what this is. This is a very nice skirt. I like this one. And if not, it's oh, my sister will take it. This is one of the items that we share. And I'm talking about my sister who lives in Amsterdam. I don't know that. That's still quite trendy. I keep that though, you've never worn it. I could wear it now. I'm big enough. <laughs> that was one of the reasons why I no, never wore it because it was too big for me. Nice also. Oh, side. this is the nice. I keep that. You keep it? Mm. Ah. I went through a phase of buying all these black and white things. But this is quite new and I love this one. Just to give you an update, dear friends, we have gone through the bottom row. Yes! No, but we hardly threw anything out. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going back in. That's quite That's nice. That's a nice one, yeah. Also. Black and white is my thing. You've never seen me wear this? No. Yeah, it's a great one, this. I'll keep that. I just need to prepare the buttons. Ditto. Ditto, I love this one. Ditto. Ditto, charity. A lot of them have still got the labels on them. This is a wearer jacket, size extra small, 12 pounds. I love that jacket, very nice cloth. You love it so much, you've never worn it. No, I have worn it, but I mean, it, it, it's difficult with that bump. This is the classic one, remember? Yes, but... Wait till you see me wear it. This is a Ferre Milano, also from the charity. I can't close it, but it's very nice, isn't it? Mm. Oh, I would say. Okay. I believe this is from Gap. I know, it's so gorgeous, isn't it? Very nice. Obviously oh. a nice vintage. If you're ever not pregnant, you could wear that one. That one is so well, easy. borderline anyway. Definitely keep. Oh, wow. Definitely keep. Again, I need to fix the buttons. I put that out. No, this is very gorgeous. I put that out. <gasps> no, I like that one. I put that out, top shot. Oh no, this is very nice. It's not turning into much of a clean out. <laughs> I put that out. Like what is holy? I'd keep that. Yeah, this is nice. This is from Korea. You like? Yeah, I do. I'd get rid of that one. What? This classic one. We bought this. This is supposed to be a wardrobe yeah. clear out. What? This, it's, we got. It's French connection. Yeah, we got this when we first got married. I mean, when we got married. When we first got married. When we got married first. After our first wedding, because we had three. I put that out. Yeah. I put that out. Fine. I'd keep that. Classic vintage. I'd keep that if you can get into it. I'd keep this. Yeah, this is actually too small for me. I put that out. American. This is very, very London. This is a maternity shop. I'd keep that. Yeah, this is wonderful. I got this from Indonesia. Dorothy Perkins. <laughs> what? 20 years dead. <laughs> I'll throw that out. Okay. Keep that. Nice J. Crew second hand. Definitely keep that. Should have been wearing it. Yeah. Definitely put that out. How are we doing? Wow. Well, that tells you nothing because you've got to put 90% of it back in. <laughs> this one we got from Russia, from that flea market, and I thought it was a nice dress for girls, but it turns out to be a top for women. <laughs> this is nice. I got this recently from Korea. Keeps you nice and warm. Yeah, this Made is in nice. Ireland. Didn't my mother like, buy you this? It used to be hers. So oh, it, it used to be hers. Okay. So I had this on when we went to Ireland. Not sure when you would wear this. I wear this in our fantastic family picture. Okay, that's it. That's it. There you go. So here we have the end result. Keep, 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 keep. And these are going to be chucked out. But these are the pieces that I need to convince him of are worthy of staying. And just to show you how serious I was about uh, tidying up my wardrobe, I bought these velvet hangers, 100 pieces, to make sure I don't go past them. So now I've got uniform hangers. And only 100 pieces, so that's the limit. I can have no more in my wardrobe. How about that?